Hi there, everyone. This is Stephen Kelly from the Century College Center for Educational Technology. In this final video on how to set up the gradebook in D2L, we will learn how to preview a gradebook from a student's perspective and how to release the final grade calculations to students. To begin, here we are in the grades area of D2L on a page called User List. To access User List, we go over to the Grades area box on the left hand side of the screen and we click on the Enter Grades option. When creating a gradebook in D2L, it is often helpful to see what the gradebook will look like to students when they view it. Previewing the gradebook from a student's perspective is a great way to double check and make sure that your chosen gradebook settings are displaying the information you want. Let's see what the gradebook on this page looks like from the student perspective. To do that, we want to hover down over Woody Woodduck's name in the gradebook, and we'll click on Woody Woodduck. And on the following page, we have some button options above, and one of them is Preview. When we click Preview, a new pop-up window is displayed that shows us the view of the gradebook from the student's perspective. Notice we have a category called Reflection Papers, a grade item called Reflection Paper on Waddling, a category called Duck Calling Quizzes, and a grade item called Quiz 1. Notice though we don't have displayed the final grade calculation. To display the final grade calculation to students, we want to return to the user list page by clicking on Enter Grades, and then we want to find the final calculated grade area. And in the final calculated grade area of our gradebook, there should be a small ruler and check mark icon, and we want to click that small icon. On the following page, we have some button options on top, and one of them is Release All Final Grades to Users. I will click Release All. I am then prompted this action will release the final calculated grade to all two users. Are you sure you want to continue and save all changes, including any other unsaved changes on the page? This action cannot be undone. I will click Yes, but note that even though D2L says this action cannot be undone, it can in fact be undone. Note now that in the Release Final Calculated Grade section of our gradebook, we have checkboxes for each student showing that we have released the final calculated grade. I will now click Save. And then I am prompted, you are about to save changes. Are you sure you want to continue? I will click Yes. Returning then to the user list, I can click on Woody Wood Duck's name. And then again, click on Preview. And note now that the final calculated grade is visible to Woody Woodduck. This is how you preview a gradebook from a student's perspective and release the final calculation grades to students in D2L.